Today, I'll be going over the top video editing programs for every platform. I'm Ryan, and on this channel, I cover photography and cinematography, tutorials, tips, and tricks. So the first part of this video is on mobile. By mobile, I mean phones or tablets. So for people with iPhones, the inferior platform, I recommend using iMovie or VideoLeap. The one you choose depends on your individual use case. I personally would use iMovie, but that's just me. Now for the iPad, I can only recommend LumaFusion. This is by far the best video editing program for mobile devices out there. It has nearly all all the features of professional editors like Final Cut Pro and most editors could get by with just LumaFusion. However, I require some more advanced features which only exist in more professional programs like Final Cut and Adobe Premiere. For both Android phones and tablets, I recommend Premiere Rush. This is because even though while I dislike Premiere Rush, it's the best Android option I could find. And as an Android user, I find it frustrating that I am unable to access better programs like Video Leap on a Samsung tablet. Especially considering higher end tablets like the Galaxy Tab S7 are much better than the iPad Pro because of features like depth. What program do you use to edit your videos? Let me know in the comments down below. I personally use Final Cut Pro on a Mac, but that's just because I prefer the magnetic timeline. The second part of this video is on the desktop. By a desktop computer, I mean laptops or desktops that run Windows or Mac OS or Linux. So for Linux, I can only recommend one program, which is Resolve. Resolve is a great editor whether you have the free or paid version, and it has nearly all the features that other editing programs have. Now, if you're in Windows land, I recommend Resolve if you're looking for a free option. This is because, as I mentioned in the Linux section, even the free version of Resolve has most of the features that any editor would need. However, if you're willing to pay for your editor, which I recommend you do, I recommend Adobe Premiere Pro. Even though it has a very high price of $30 a month, it's the best editor available for Windows. It has professional features such as Dynamic Link, which allows you to use it with After Effects easily. If you're on a Mac, I recommend using iMovie if you're not looking to spend any money. While it does lack some of the more advanced features, most editors will be able to get by with the features it has. When you become more advanced, you can install a program like Resolve, and that will give you the features that iMovie lacks. If you're on a Mac and willing to pay for your editing program, however, I recommend Final Cut Pro. As I mentioned before, this is the editing software that I personally use. It's a $500 one-time payment, however, there are rumors of it going to a subscription model soon. I switched to Mac for Final Cut because the magnetic timeline speeds up my workflow a lot. However, before buying a Mac and Final Cut, especially if you're switching from Windows, do your research to see if the magnetic timeline is right for you. Click the video on screen to learn how to get the most important part of your videos right. But first, click here to subscribe.